Unit Two, Fit for Life. Exercise One, Page Twenty-Eight. One, A, Mat. Two, E, Helmet. Three, D, Flippers. Four, I, Boxing Gloves. Five, C, Wetsuit. Six, F, Rollerblades. Seven, G, hoop. Eight, B, snorkel. Nine, H, punch bag. Exercise three, page twenty-nine. One. Wow, Tony! Nice shot. Thanks, Ben. You threw the ball straight through the hoop. Yeah, we're winning the game now. Two. Hi, Lucy. Where are you going? To my kickboxing lesson. But it starts in ten minutes. Don't worry. I'm wearing my rollerblades so I can get there really fast. Three. Hey, Helen. Are you free now? Hi, Alice. Yes. Why? There's a yoga class in thirty minutes. Great. Let me get my mat. Two A. Exercise one. Page thirty. Yang Sports Blog. Hi everyone. Do you enjoy sports? I didn't like PE lessons in primary school, but I started going to Taekwondo classes last year, and I love it. During my first lesson, I found out that Taekwondo is a Korean martial art, and it's about 2,000 years old. Taekwondo takes place in a doyang, and we wear a special uniform. We also wear a belt. And its color shows what level we are. I had a white belt when I started, but now I have a green one. One day I want to have a black belt like my teacher. In Taekwondo competitions, we wear a helmet and pads for protection. Two people fight each other, and we get points for kicks and punches. However, we are always polite to the person we are fighting because, more than anything, Taekwondo is about respect. What about you? What sport do you do? Exercise six, page thirty-one. One, jogging. Two, football. Three, swimming. Four, volleyball. Five, table tennis. Six, badminton. Two C, exercise one, page thirty-four. Fruit and vegetables, orange juice, salad, grapes, carbohydrates, cereal, bread, pizza, rice. Pasta, soup, biscuits, proteins, 
milk, fish, meat, steak, chicken, burger, fats, ice cream. Exercise 4, page 34. Do you like pizza? Yes, a lot. I eat pizza almost every evening. Well, you shouldn't eat too much pizza. It contains too much fat. Why don't you have some soup instead? It's healthy. I guess you are right. Two D. Exercise 2, page 35. Hello, Dan. What would you like today? Let's see. I'd like chicken and potatoes, please. OK. Would you like carrots or salad with that? A small portion of each, please. You're hungry today. How about dessert? We've got apple pie or ice cream. Ice cream, please. OK. Anything to drink? A glass of orange juice, please. So, that's chicken and potatoes with carrots and salad, ice cream and a glass of orange juice. That's six pounds, please. Here you are. Thank you. Pronunciation. W, v, page 35. W, what, wood, water, waiter. V, very, vegetables, valley, village. Two F, exercise one, page thirty-eight. School sports day in the UK. Every June in the UK, each school takes part in school sports day. This year, we held ours on the twenty-eighth of June. There were no lessons. We were all outside on the playing field. The students were in many teams. We wore shorts and t-shirts in our team color. We had events like the 100 meter race, but there were other games too. I liked the three-legged race. You tie one leg to your partners and run. We also had sack races. You stand in a potato sack and hop to the finish line. This year, I won. There were races for our teachers and parents too. This year, my science teacher won the teacher's race. My dad didn't take part in the parents' race. He said he had a headache, but I think that was an excuse. My team didn't win this year, but we had a lot of fun. Exercise 4, page 39. 1. Relay. 2. High jump. 3. Long jump. 4. Tug of war. 5. Team building game. Exercise 7, page 39. Good morning. Here's an announcement about our annual sports day. 
This year is on the 8th of June. It's the 21st sports day since the school opened, and every year it's bigger and better. Events begin at 9.30, but everyone needs to be at school at 8.45. Do not be late. We want all our pupils to join in, so there are lots of events. Last year we had 12 different events, but this year we're having 16. We have something very special at the end of the day. Paul Abbott, the kickboxing champion, is handing out the medals. There is also a special prize thanks to Taylor's sports shop for the pupil who tried their best in all events. Our annual sports day is a great day and I'm looking forward to seeing you all. Clue 2, Exercise 1, page 40. One. A headache. Two. A sore throat. Three. A stomach ache. Four. A temperature. Five. A cough. Exercise three, page forty. Medicine in the kitchen. We all feel sick sometimes. Luckily, Lots of things in your kitchen can make you feel better. Do you usually feel unpleasant in your head? Drink some lemon juice with warm water to stop your headache. For a stomach ache, drink some ginger tea. It's healthy and good for your stomach. Honey can help a sore throat. Add a teaspoon of honey to hot water and drink. It's good for your throat. When you've got a temperature, drink a cup of mint tea to help reduce body temperature. Chocolate has the same ingredients in it as cough syrup, so it can stop a terrible cough. Sounds great, right? The things in our kitchen cupboards can help us a lot. But remember, always check with a doctor first. Progress Check 2, Exercise 8, Page 4. Progress Check 2, Exercise 8, Page 43. Hello, I'm Gary Haven, the manager of Croft Sports Centre, and I want to invite all the listeners to come along and try all the sports we have. We offer a variety of indoor and outdoor sports. We also offer kickboxing lessons from a famous champion. The cost depends on the sport, ranging from 5 to 25 pounds per day. But we also offer a special yearly membership that covers all sports for just 200 pounds. A lot of the sports here are not for young children, so members must be at least 16. However, we have a play park for children up to 12. You can find us just outside of town near Butte Forest. For more information, check ghaven at croftsportscenter.com.